Today, we're babysitting baby Vampirina, baby Catboy, and... Wait! Where is our third baby? This silly baby is always acting naughty. He's always up to his evil plans. But where did he go? We have to find him before lunchtime. Can you help me find him? <laughs> hey, did you hear that? Ah, there is our missing baby. Baby Romeo. and I fell and hit my head. I think Catboy made me fall. Romeo, you see what happens when you're naughty? You fall and get hurt. Silly Romeo. You need to sit in your high chair and we'll make your boo-boo feel all better. I'll get you a band-aid. We have special Paw Patrol band-aids. Everyone loves Paw Patrol. Where does it hurt? Right here on your head? Okay, there you go. All better. Now it's time for the babies to eat lunch. <laughs> Who wants some of this yummy food? V is first. Take a bite, V. Good girl. Isn't it tasty? Yeah. Purple is your favorite. I bet you'll eat all of it. You must have been pretty hungry. Now it's Catboy's turn. What color do you want, Catboy? This one? Okay, let's get this baby food for you. Catboy's always a really hungry baby. Can anyone tell me what color this baby food is? Let me know in the comments. This food is so slippy. Eat it all up, cat boy. Good job. Okay, now Romeo needs to eat too. Here you are. Take a bite of your yummy baby food, Romeo. No. Romeo, you have to eat. Or you'll get too hungry in the middle of the night. No! This food is yucky! I don't want to eat. I want to play! Play! No, Romeo. It's bedtime, not playtime. But if you don't want to eat, you don't have to. But what we do need to do is go potty before bed. Let's take the babies to the bathroom. Now, who wants to go potty first? You, Vampirina? Okay. Do you think you can go potty tonight? You have to use your potty. But you can't use the potty while you're wearing a diaper. We have to change your diaper first. All set. Sit down and try. Now, let's get Catboy ready. Catboy ate a lot of food. And now he wants to use the potty real bad. He's going to take his diaper off too. Now sit on your potty and wait for Romeo. Perfect. Okay, Romeo, you're up next. Time to take your diaper off and sit on your potty. No, I don't like going potty. When I go, I like to use my diaper. Potties are for babies, like those PJ Maxx. I'm not taking my diaper off, ever. Romeo, don't be so naughty. You still have to sit on the potty and practice. Potties are for big kids. And it's fun to potty train. Okay, babies. Just let me know when you finish using the potty. And we'll get ready for bed. Hey, wait. I think Vampirina is ready. Did you go potty, V? You did? Good girl. I knew you were a big girl. Then we have to flush the potty. Now, sit here and wait while we see how Catboy's doing. Did you go potty, Catboy? Are you all done? Yes! Catboy is a big boy too! Excellent! Good job! You have to flush your potty too! Now, only one more potty to check. You can sit here 
and wait for Romeo again. Okay, Romeo, it's your turn. Did you go potty like a big boy? No, I told you. I'm not going to use that potty. I'll only use my diaper. It's way easier. Romeo, you can't wear diapers forever. You have to at least try. I bet everyone is really sleepy. Time to go to the bedroom. Wow, this bed is really big. And it even rocks back and forth. Okay, babies, it's time to put on our pajamas. Who wants to go first? Vampirina, let's get these PJs on you. These pink pajamas are so soft. They're her favorite PJs. She's being such a good girl, well, I'll put them on. If you keep being a good girl, then we can have a surprise toy. I'm so excited for that. And we're all done. Her PJs look awesome. Now who is next? Catboy. Our blue PJ Masks hero is ready to put his pajamas on too. Catboy normally wears blue PJs to bed, but tonight he'll wear these special pajamas. Catboy really wants a surprise toy, but he's always a good boy even when he doesn't get any toys. All nice and ready for bed, Catboy! Good job! Now, there is only one more baby to dress. Okay, Romeo, time to put on your PJs. PJs? As in PJ masks? No way! The PJ masks are always ruining my plans. I'm not wearing my PJs to bed. Oh, Romeo, why can't you be a good baby just for once like Catboy and Vampirina? Whoever was a good baby today gets a surprise toy. That's so awesome! Let's take a look at who got a toy. B must have been a good girl because she got a toy. Catboy was good too, so he gets a toy. But Romeo, you don't get a toy today. Hey, that's not fair. I want a toy. Why didn't I get one? Romeo, you have to be a good boy to get a toy. But you didn't eat when I told you to. You wouldn't go potty, and you wouldn't put your pajamas on. So sorry, but you didn't get anything, Romeo. But I want one, please! Ellie, please! Okay, Romeo. If you drink your milk bottle, then you can have a surprise toy. Deal? Yuck! I don't like drinking my bottle. But okay, I'll do it this time. Good job, Romeo. And here you go. First, we'll open Vampirina's. She got a Disney Happy Places surprise toy. I love these surprise books. And look! We got Cinderella's home decor. The first item is Cinderella's tissues. Tissues are great for when you have a runny nose or the sniffles. These are the tissues Cinderella uses when she sneezes. How cool! But what else goes with it? An alarm clock! This is how Cinderella wakes up every morning. Okay, boys and girls, do you have an alarm clock to wake you up for school in the morning? Let me know in the comments. There's only one more item in Cinderella's story. And it's a very special cup. You can tell it's Cinderella's because it has a pumpkin on it. All of Cinderella's stuff today had pumpkins on them. Cool. These are all yours, V. It's time for us to open up Catboy's toy. Catboy got a Disney Simpson Colourpop blind bag. I 
love Tim Tims. And the Tim Tim we got is Pluto. Pluto is a Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, and his Mickey's fun pet dog. He's orange with a red color. And he's really big. Even though Catboy has cat superpowers, he still loves silly dogs like Pluto. Tsum Tsums are so fun because all of the Disney movies and shows are super awesome. Now only one more toy to open. Romeo's toy. Romeo almost didn't get a toy because he was naughty all day. But he did get something and it's a Trolls blind bag. Wow, Trolls are awesome. But who did he get? He got King Peppy. King Peppy is a really nice king of trolls that is also Poppy's daddy. His favorite thing to say is, No trolls left behind! Especially when the villain chef is chasing the trolls. Doesn't King Peppy look extra colorful with his big giant pink hair? That's really fun! Now that everyone opened their toys, it's time to cuddle up and go to sleep. I'm happy that we finally fed everyone, had them go potty, and put their pajamas on. Good night, babies, and sweet dreams. Rockabye babies on the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. Wow, that was fast. They're asleep already. Okay, PJ Masks and Vampirina fans. Are you ready for another Ellie Sparkles adventure? Let's go!